what did Merkel and Conte actually agree going into this summit for Friday? Well, Menace, it's interesting because Angela Merkel and Giuseppe Conte, the, the Italian prime minister, which is the country that would benefit uh, the most if we do get this recovery fund, agreed this week when European leaders meet here in Brussels, both said that the $500 billion in grants should not be lowballed. That amount should stay put, and that is needed to prop up the European economy. When you look at the big differences now in terms of getting this deal through the finish line, it's not so much the amount or the size of it, actually, it's the governance. If this money is agreed, if this money is handed out to countries badly hit by the coronavirus, like Spain or Italy, who is going to check that it is being well spent and that it's being used in a way that props growth in a sustainable way and actually does encourage reforms? And that is where we feel at this point the tension is here. It's not much on the amounts, but the way of, you know, just the governance. Who is going to make sure that the money is used properly. And this is where countries, the so-called frugal four, are now playing this very hardball because they do want to see a more traditional type of bailout. You know, I give you money, I give you cash, you deliver on reforms. And that could be problematic <clears throat> for a country like Italy because they don't want to hear anything that looks like a troika. No, that's the last thing that uh, anybody wants to sort of see. Um, what can we expect from the leaders then uh, as we go to the close of the week? Do you think that they'll seal the deal? Is there enough, is there enough momentum, Maria? Well, I think at this point, the mood has changed. Uh, there are more pieces behind the scenes that will tell you a deal is likely, and this could turn into a summit that runs for three days. But we do get some light at the end of the tunnel come Sunday. Let's just keep in mind that Europeans meet for the first time uh, on Friday, and we're expecting this summit to potentially even go up to, two, to three days. Uh, but the sticking point, again, is whether countries like the Netherlands do believe there has been enough goodwill on the front of, you know, reform and the governance of the deal overall. But the mood has changed. There is more optimism going into the meeting. And if anything, if it doesn't go through, what we are hearing is that there could be another summit for the week of the 17th. 27th, excuse me. <laughs>